This is the story of a woman who was hit by a meteorite while mapping in 1954. Her name, Anne Hodges, remains the only human ever known to have been injured by a direct impact from a meteorite that passed through our atmosphere. Now, this incident is so extremely rare that one astronomer stated that you have a better chance of getting hit by a tornado and a bolt of lightning and a hurricane all at the same time than getting hit by a meteorite when you're sleeping in your own home. But what really happens as a meteorite or small asteroid, you could say, is entering our atmosphere. As a meteorite, a small particle of rock that is hurtling towards Earth, it will encounter our planet's protective shield. This is where the magic happens. The meteorite doesn't just calmly glide in. It hits the atmosphere at incredible speed, sometimes reaching tens of thousands of miles per hour. As the meteorite plunges through the air, it experiences intense friction with the atmospheric gases, causing it to heat up and glow. The color of the meteor trail can actually tell us a lot about the meteorite's composition. Different elements emit distinct colors when heated, giving us a valuable clues about these extraterrestrial visitors. When multiple meteorites enter the atmosphere at the same time, we are treated to a spectacular phenomenon known as a meteor shower. It's like nature's own celestial firework display. Now, usually when you go outside to view a meteor shower, they happen a good amount of times through the year. They are just extremely small particles of space rocks that go into the atmosphere and glow, leaving a beautiful streak. But what if the space rock that enters the atmosphere is as big as a basketball or even bigger? This is when the rock might have a chance of surviving its passage through the atmosphere and even hit the Earth intact. These are called meteorites, which are like time capsules from space. They can contain clues about the early solar system, and some even carry extraterrestrial materials that are not found on Earth. Scientists study them to unlock the mysteries of cosmic compositions. You'll probably be very surprised when I tell you that over 17,000 meteorites fall to Earth every single year. And only a portion of these actually make it to the ground in particles big enough for you to see and pick up or hold in your hand. Any of them just break apart and the only thing that makes it down to earth is just sand particles from the meteorite. But this extremely unlucky 34 year old woman was hit by one that actually made it to earth in a fairly decent size. It was approximately 8.5 pounds and it shot like a bullet through her house roof at 2.46 p.m. Luckily though it didn't hit her directly otherwise this would have been a fatality. It banged into her large radio and bounced onto her body, causing a massive burn on her left side. This was a large meteor and it actually split in two before it fell to the ground, one piece going through her roof and another a few miles away. And later, the second meteorite was actually found. Later, after more research was done, they found that it was approximately moving at 200 kilometers per hour and that it was about the size of a basketball. This is an extremely rare occurrence as there has only been one human in recorded history that this has happened to. So you probably don't need to worry while you're sleeping in bed at night that a meteorite is just gonna fall, make it through your roof, and kill you. One thing you can do is go outside on a clear night and watch as tiny particles of space rock plummet through the atmosphere at incredible speeds, causing a beautiful streak of light. If you enjoyed this short episode, make sure to subscribe as we continue to explore the wonders and dangers of the universe.